What's going on guys, Marge here, Nifty Under 50. Do you remember a couple of weeks ago I did the Nintendo Classic Mini to give you an idea of what gaming was like a few years back? Um, well, I've showed you the Nintendo, I wanted to show you the other rival gaming console that was killing it at the time. It was the Sega Mega Drive. Now they've actually released a classic mini version of the original console, which I've got. That's what we're checking out today. Now this isn't actually uh, manufactured by Sega which I had later realized uh, it's actually just licensed by Sega so but that doesn't matter because you still get the classic games that we all remember Mortal Kombat 1, 2 and 3, the Sonic games and you've also got uh, you've also got Golden Axe do you remember Golden Axe? if you don't know what Golden Axe is then I don't think I can be your friend and I wanted to check this out to show you what gaming was like when I was a kid growing up. You know, the variety of games, the music, the iconic characters, and the fact that you couldn't even save the game. Good days though. Good memories. Come on. Yes, yes. Almost done. I'm coming! Anyway, uh, here it is. It comes with two wireless controllers and the console itself. Uh, it's also got a slot there, so if you've got some old Sega Mega Drive games, you can actually put them in and uh, play those old games that you've got. Uh, but other than that, let's uh, open it up and see what it comes with. Okay, so the unboxing experience isn't amazing, to be honest with you. It's just a massive egg carton. Um, so, okay, well, that's fine. Includes a power adapter, some AV cables, two con wireless controllers, they're actually smaller than the ones from before, and then all the buttons, menu start, directions, and then the uh, the bashing buttons as I call them. So there's the console itself, it's really small, as you can see, um, there's the slot for the old games, on and off button, menu button, and that's about it really. So I'm going to hook this thing up, and I'll just go through a few of the classic games that come with this console. Okay, so we're all ready to go now. So here are a list of the games. Golden Axe 2. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh yes. Well, let's go for that. Yep, Night Wolf, so... What? Oh. oh, there we go. What the f... So there you have it, the Sega Mega Drive Classic Edition. It brings back some great memories, you know, and some not so great memories. You've got a few friends around, you've got a couple of uh, controllers with it, play all the old school games, more Kombat, Sonic, that kind of thing, and you've got obviously the slot to put the old games in as well. Now there is one annoying thing about the console, and that is these wireless controllers. They're not great. Um, if you're not pointing directly at the console, it doesn't pick it up, so you're there bashing away and your character's doing nothing on the screen so you really have to point directly at the console but to avoid this 
you can't just get yourself a wired controller and that's it, job done. But you know, it's under £50, so can't really complain. You get to play those retro games, all those classic games that you love. So that's it guys, my take on the Sega Mega Drive Classic Edition. Uh, guess my thumbs up. As always, if you want to buy one, I'll put the link in the description down below. Please subscribe, like, share, write a comment if you want, all that kind of stuff. And apart from that, this is Nifty Under 50, my name is Madge, I'll see you next time.